you... All right, okay, so I'm, we're just coming up to speed on sound. That takes me about 10 seconds. So we're at four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, and let her rip anytime you want. Well, we have here another munch pack. Oh, yes, we do. Oh, let me explain. My peeps, my peeps. I'm, I, <laughs> I'm sitting behind the camera because I need to stay as far away from extra um, goodies as I can tonight because I weigh in tomorrow. If it were any other night, I would be over there munching those suckers down. <laughs> But I'm going to I'm going to practice some restraint tonight. But I want you guys to get a load of the back of the backdrop. I mean, I've got crap piled everywhere, and this is what about 300 percent cleaner than it was oh, yeah. three days ago. <laughs> yeah, now, I've been washing everything in the house. So you're you know welcome to my world. All right, Mr. G, let's uh, let's show the people what we got. Well, and and uh, you will want to kind of move along. You know, well, move along. With haste, of course. Yeah. Let's look. Yeah. Uh, we have here Doritos. Oh, those Doritos look lovely. Oh, absolutely. What flavor are they? Well, this is uh, pizza rola, so they're pizza flavor. Pizza, Doritos. Where do they come from? I would expect a product of Mexico. Okay, okay. Maybe I'm gonna come. I'm gonna get come in a little bit closer on on you so we can really see the packaging. Okay, and God, they look good. They taste. My like mouth is pizza. watering. They taste like pizza. Okay, good, good. All righty. Mm. Now we have a falafel flavored wheat stack. Oh, I love falafel. And this is coming from. It reminds Israel. it Israel. reminds me of Grateful Dead concert, concerts. <laughs> you walk through one of those and it smells like pot and falafel. <laughs> at least it used to. I don't know what Little crazy sticks. crap people are doing at a Grateful Dead concert now. Okay, so what were those again? They little, yeah, little, little sticks. Little sticks. Okay, and do they taste like falafel? A bit, yes. Good. Yeah. So, if they don't taste exactly like falafel, do you um, uh, detect any other flavor? My problem is I have some residual from the pizza. Oh yeah, that can be a problem. I need to grab my water cup, and hopefully there's enough water in it. Can you pause that? No, no, no. Oh, no. there's not enough water in it. I'm oh. gonna grab water. Okay, oh, I'm gonna turn around and talk to you guys for a second. So, um, yeah. I have been, um, I have been cleaning like a big dog. We, well, and Grant, I mean, I came home the other day and he was in the bathroom on his hands and knees scrubbing the toilet. I mean, if that does not make a woman's heart swell with admiration and love, I can't tell you what, what does. So anyhow, let's get back to uh, Grant and his munch pad. Well, we have this one here called Cracks, and it looks so similar to the falafel sticks, hmm. but I it, I can't even read it Cracks. because it's in it's in like Turkish or I can't tell even what country yet. All right, that's but okay. we will find out. It looks like it has Swiss cheese flavoring, which okay. should be good. I love Swiss cheese. You yes. Can see the Swiss oh cheese yes, wedge. yes. Oh, tear into that sucker. That's something new to me. Yeah. I mean, that having a a snack with Swiss cheese. I know, and you are going to have to um, hide this good. Grant and I have this uh, this thing going where whenever he brings home the sweet and salty snacks these days, he hides them from me so well that I can't find them even when I'm creeping around at night and he, I think he's asleep in the other room. <laughs> so good job, Grant. So tell me about those. Are they good? Lots of good salt. Okay. Oh, and onion. There's a little onion so, ring. I haven't seen those. So, so do they live up to their name? Can you imagine yourself s selling I, your I body like on I the like other side of town so you could get some more? I like them. Okay. Really so the cracks yeah. gets a gets a yeah. gets a solid pass. Okay. Well, yeah. I mean, not pass it up, but pass as opposed to pass or fail. 
God, this my autism looks, is showing tonight. Okay. This one looks to be a strawberry chew. Ooh, ooh, what's the brand? Um, Crown. Okay, that's a brand I haven't heard of. Um, it the the writing on it looks to be Korean. Okay, alrighty. So I'm going to well, presume hmm. that it's coming from Korea, but yeah, there's basically. Uh, just a few English words on it. Wow and strawberry uh -huh. and crown. Uh -huh. and, and Alrighty. So let's, it's, let's, it's one of those that's... Let's open that sucker up. Oh, look at this. Memories. Do you remember when they used a little, a little tab? Oh, a yeah. A pull tab. I think they still do. Sometimes, but yeah, you, you don't uh, chew gum, so you wouldn't experience it. Well, that's it. true. Okay. See how this little strawberry thing, how much okay. strawberry taste it has. All righty. Let's ho hope it has a lot. Absolutely. The suspense is killing us, Grant. And what's a verdict? Pretty strong strawberry. Oh, good. Yeah. You yeah. know, generally speaking, um, South Korean stuff is very high quality. Yeah. They have the best skincare products, I think. In the in a reasonable consumer price point of anywhere in the world. I mean, you can pay a lot more for something else, but I love their skincare products. Now this one is a Polish. Looks like a little waffle. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, so it's with like chocolate with like a, a chocolate middle layer or something. Okay, so it's a um, it's a variation on the theme of strop waffle. Yeah, I would say. It's good. I'm glad we have something different than just a straw right. waffle. Something may have happened to it en route. It looks like it got a little bit crushed. Oh, well, that's all right. It'll still taste the same. Oh, yeah. Do you want to take a sip of water before you move on? I think that would be a good idea. <laughs> I'm full of good ideas. Okay, so we have chocolate and waffle wafer. Very nice. Oh, that nice. looks so good. Make sure you finish that one, one of the first ones you finish, because <laughs> I'm going to dream about that tonight. <laughs> oh, Lord. Okay. Biscotti, and this looks to be... Biscotti? Um, it's a product of Pakistan. Okay, all righty. It's a chocolate cookie with chocolate filling. Oh, oh, yeah. Chocolate all the way yeah. around. Yeah, chocolate on chocolate is always good. Let's move. Let's move along. Got to move along. The intensity of the chocolate looks a little bit. Oh, it's light. pretty. Mm. It looks like a little but pinwheel. Oh, look at that! Yeah. Okay. Very good. And again, what's the name of it? I'm sorry? What's the name of it? It's a Chocolato. Chocolato. Okay, got it. Yeah. You always want to hold up the product. Yep. And we have this one. Is a caramel Oh, chicken. my God. That looks good. Oh, anything caramel. And... I would tell you where it comes from that's if okay. I could read the label. Yeah, that's okay. That's all right. We can move. We can move along. Yeah, no dead air. No dead oh, air. Boy. You just keep going. Yeah. And so what we have here is apparently. Oh, it's beautiful. I, oh, Little cookies. Well, or cookie. it's super layered. It's like oh. triple layered or something. Huh. Huh. That looks excellent. Definitely caramel. Yeah. Are you guys having fun trying to identify some of the junk in the background? I bet you want to know what that pink thing is. Well, at the end of the video, I will show you. <laughs> okay, so. Actually, I think there are three pink things in the shop. Well, sorry, you guys. Well, four if you count the umbrella. Okay. Now we have Dolcetto Petites. Okay, okay. Uh -oh. Lemon wafer. That bites. sounds good. Oh, lemon. That is your favorite. 
Absolutely. And I can't tell the country of origin. No, oh, it's in uh, Indonesia. Indonesia, okay. Ooh, it already smells wonderful. Ooh. And what's it supposed to taste like? Lemon. Okay. And, and does it taste like lemon? Lemon can be hit or miss. Um, artificial lemon flavor can be nasty. Or it can be really wonderful. It's like a flaky, you know, type of a crispy okay. shell. Okay. Alrighty. Alrighty. So, right. so, so far so good on these, right? We're, yeah. I don't think you've identified one dang thing that isn't awesome. No. Tinder. Oh. Cards. And so oh. they doubtless have something. Oh, open it up and show us. Oh, that's going to be interesting. And this one has absolutely no identification stuff on it. Okay, well. It's not pro It's not labeled for individual retail yeah. sales. We know it's from somewhere. That we, we've determined that it's from somewhere. And the cards. Little tablets. Yeah. Cute. And this one says on it, Kinder. So it's only mm -hmm. for children? Can, can I eat it? Well, you act like a kid most of the time, so go ahead. Oh. That's a compliment, darling. Mm. Mm. Oh, look at that. It has a, Is creamy, that... a creamy chocolate and a creamy sort of vanilla flavor of center. It looks like coconut. No? No, no, oh, okay. it, it's, it's um, just part of the soft filling. Oh, very nice. Very nice. And, uh, I'm, and uh, I'm definitely getting the chocolate. I'm trying to see if I can distinguish other flavors as well. What's its texture? Is it flaky or crispy? Well, there's or? a flaky crust on the bottom, and the top has more of a soft. Oh, okay. Okay, see, that's important. Texture is important to people. Actually, the center is where all the all the soft is. Right. Okay. So is it a is it a is it a hit or a miss? It's a definite hit. Okie dokie. Let's move on. I just can't tell you too many details that's okay now Just manufacture some that's what i on, that, on that one well, no what? i'm kidding huh i'm kidding there's a sour thing you know the reason why we need to taste the sour things is to to determine their intensity of sour are they super sour or are they somewhere in the middle so that's why a little nibble on that is a good idea well I this mean, one tells us it's coming from the Netherlands. Okay. And that it's supposed to be belts. Mm. Well, I think... Assorted wide belts in flavors of strawberry, green apple, blue raspberry, and tutti frutti. Okay, so give a give a little nibble so on I'm, one maybe or... Maybe I'll try a strawberry just to, yeah. to compare strawberries here. Yeah, that's a good idea. There you go. Here's the I'll always incorporate more meaning and yeah. into your thing. God. Oh, Grant, we're waiting. You have to tell us. It's very sour. I'm trying to okay, catch the it, strawberry. It's very sour. Okay, that's good to know. And this is the original since 1985. Okay, that's that also is good to know. That's good yeah. to know, yeah. That's, it's nice to know anything from 1985 is still around. <laughs> okay, let's move along. Where are we at the next thing? Well, at this point, we come to the finale. The finale, okay. Now, I know you're not huge into soda, but I would like you to taste it. So you can give us a, just a, a taste. They give us instruction on how to open it. Oh, that's the one with a little ball in it. Yeah. Yeah. Open off the seal, lift the cap, push the center to release the opener. Place the opener onto the top of the ram line bottle. All you really need to do is open it up. Just open it. I have to figure out how to do it myself. Yeah. Just pull off that plastic thing and it will magically um, explode. No, it won't explode. The little ball is going to drop. It's got um, mm. it's got like a base of some kind on it. Yeah, so you take the blue thing. I believe the blue thing comes off. But maybe uh, you're supposed to push this though, maybe, huh? No? No, I believe you have to take that blue thing off because you're not going to uh -huh. get any. 
That blue thing doesn't look very really Oh, really push the... Okay, well... I think right. you push this down. All right. Okay, okay. But I could be wrong. All right, you know what? It, yeah. Part of our problem is that we are not smarter than the bottle. Neither Grant nor I are smarter than the bottle. So just well, tell us about the flavor. What is it supposed to be? Well, it's supposed to be a green apple flavor. Okay. All right. Carbonated. You, you know, it's funny. I've opened three or four of these in my life, and I never... Um, it gives us something about... Uh, see, it's... You, it, it, it looks as though you're using this to push it down. There we go. You oh, were. I didn't separate those two parts yet. Oops. Oh, no. This you, is the part yeah, you, you Yeah, you weren't supposed yeah. to. You were supposed to push from the from top. From the other side. With okay. your, no, no, with your finger down through the center. That's ah. where you screwed up. So No, no, no. No, this doesn't. This can't be on when you do it. This is what opens it. Okay. And there we go. Okay. Now you got to look at the bubbles. Hold it up so we can see the bubbles. And we got a little bubbly glass thing in there. Yeah, so basically what it is is the glass thing's probably got baking soda on it. And it's the soda is probably a little bit acidic. Know. And I that's why it's just a your basic, well, literally your basic uh, acid base reaction. Uh, Let's all think back to our chemistry 101. That's how that works. All right, so now um, taste it. Taste it. Definitely a, a green apple flavor. Okay. Yeah. Alrighty. So, nice. so that was clean the clean and crisp. Clean, crisp, and green apple. -y. That's wonderful. Incidentally, you guys, just because you wondered, um, I need to send this off to my friend Steffi from Steffi's Beads and Baubles. Um, somewhere in my life, I think my son found a bunch of these in the trash or something, and um, there are these cookie cutters that are from uh, Michaels. Yeah, they're fairy tale princess cookie cutters. And I think I've got eight of these, and they're all something like the backs are a little bit funky. But Stephanie, she collects um, cookie cutters, so those are going to go off to her. Well, Grant, um, thank you so much for doing that for me. You're so welcome. Alrighty, and I'm going to get back to my you, you guys to say bye bye. Yeah. So anyhow, um, that's that's our latest munch pack, and. Um, I've got a bunch of stuff I want to do, but I'm busy. I am busy laundering my entire life. So I'm going to get back to it. And you guys have a wonderful day, night, whatever this is, whatever time it is when you see this. Bye. Ugh.